Hachi family. Welcome back to the channel. We are just so slack with posting, but I promise we'll get better. Excuse me, is it the Zeke show? We've been so busy with little Zeke, as you can tell. But as you can see from the title of this video, long overdue, fully furnished house tour. Everything. Yeah, yeah. Everything is nearly done. Um, so we're really excited to show you finally. So we've got a couple things. Zeke is a, is a very <laughs> lively boy. Um, so yeah, you know what? Let's just get into the tour. We will tell you where we got everything. Um, we'll let you know what's from our old house, what is new, etc., etc. But if you guys do uh, have any more. <laughs> if you do have any questions, comment down below and we'll answer them for you. I had to talk over you. I have to. Yeah. Say hi, Ziki. Say hi. Say hi. Hello. So as you can see, this is the entry table. We've got a nice mirror here for on your way in and on your way out as well. It's actually our mirror from our old house. So if you want to know where everything here is from, just go watch our original house tour from our old place. Yeah. Um, those orchids are dead, but they'll come back alive. <laughs> yeah. And also, like our old house, if you've seen that video, if you haven't, go check it out. Yeah. We've got a keypad to come in the door. Um, we also have a swipe card to get in as well, so same as the old house. And as we walk down, we have a nice long hallway. To the right, we have our powder room here, which Georgia taught me that term. <laughs> nice and small basic. for the guests. And as we keep walking down, there's a little ass door right here. People always think this is the bathroom. <laughs> I do not know why, but right here we just store all our things. It's under the stairs. We just got Zeke's stroller in there. Our suitcases, suitcase stuff like and that. Other little things, you know how it is. As we come over here, we've got our linen cupboard. It's a nice sliding door. It's a bit messy at the moment, but we've just got blankets in there, um, yeah. letters, and you know all those Everything. little things. But you know what a linen cupboard is. One day I'll do a linen organization video, and I'll do it for you guys. Yeah, yeah. Let's tell them about it. Okay. All right. So as you can see here, we have our dining room. So this table, mum and I, well, my mum and I actually found it on Marketplace. It was like this brownie, reddy color. Um, and we sanded it down and painted it like a beige color. We did, um, because obviously beige and black is like our color zone. Um, these chairs are Temple and Webster chairs. So we've actually got six of those. I just keep two of them upstairs so it's not too cluttered. Um, the little centerpiece here, I'll probably end up changing this 20 times, but this is from Kmart Candle, I can't remember where it's from, and this beautiful um, sculpture, my little sister actually bought us that for Christmas, so thank you Trini. Uh, this is the head of the table, the man of the house, Zeke boy, <laughs> got his little bib and dummy in there, but that's where he sits in his little booster seat. Um, and then over here we just keep his little swing um, and our ring light and tripod because we're always filming something It's good for it to be easily accessible. Backyards behind me. I'll let Perry do that in a second So let's but go to the kitchen. But before we go, explain oh. the table that we can make it smaller. Oh, okay, yeah. So as you can see these lines here, this actually lifts out. I won't lift it because I don't want to ruin that. This lifts out and you can push it together and make it a really small table. I thought it was going to be too big for the space, but with it extended, it actually fits perfect. So we keep it extended, but if we wanted to, we can make it a small table. So yeah. Um, over here to the kitchen, so bar stools are from our old place, um, so go watch that um, tour if you want to. I'll do the lounge room first actually, just kidding, not the kitchen. Okay, so lounge room is almost exactly 
exactly the same as the old house. So if you want to know, I get a lot of questions about where we got the couch from. I get them on Instagram, TikTok, everywhere. Um, and I got the couch from Wholesale Furniture Outlet. But if you want to see all of its features, it turns into a little cinema lounge. It's got storage. We did a whole little video on our previous house tour on how we use the couch. Oh, really? Do you want to go on the other side? Oh, okay. So then the rug and the coffee table are both from Kmart. So super affordable. I think the coffee table was like 40 bucks. I just wanted something really lightweight that I can move around easily because Zeke sometimes puts a little play mat down here um, and he plays. But yeah, so under our couch storage, that's where we fit like our blankets and also Zeke's change mat because we have a change mat downstairs and a change mat upstairs. Um, cushions are from Kmart. They're so cute. The TV stand entertainment unit, this is the same as the old one. It's obviously a bit old, it's breaking. But if you want to see where we got that from and all that, that's in our last one. Zeke's toys goes over in the corner here in this cute little basket. Uh, so that's where he keeps all his downstairs toys. Our six is a little photo of us. And that's pretty much this space. But yeah, it's almost the same as our last place. So if you want any more details that I haven't explained, either ask me a question or go check our previous furnished house tour. All right, on to the kitchen, Ziki. This is my zone. This is my happy place. This is where I come alive. So this kitchen, honestly, is my favorite kitchen we've had so far. Like, there's at least, like, I reckon a meter and a half between the two bench shops, which I love so much. The little bar area. Um, we used to have, like, a bar cart, but it's easier with Zeke now. There's up high alcohol, mine and Perry's water bottles, and this is Zeke's little baby monitor thing that we use. Um, my pride and joy, my smeg kettle and toaster that Perry got me for Mother's Day. Well, I should say Perry and Zeke. Thanks, baby. Thanks. <laughs> um, yeah, and then obviously this is just the sink. Um, dish rack is from Target. I get a lot of questions on that. Um, hand soap thing is from Kmart. All black vibes. Candle is from Alula Home. Um, and I think that's it. Tea towels are from Kmart. Do we... We have soft clothes as well, right? With yeah, our doors. So we still got soft clothes. As you can see, nothing slams. Yep, and I've organized most of the drawers. They're pretty organized. See? I'm an organized girl. Everything's got its spot. Yeah. Um, glasses. Plenty of storage at this place, right? We struggled with storage at the last place, didn't we? Yeah, we definitely did. Um, I've, there were these tiny little cabinets about this big. So now I can keep all my glasses somewhere in the dishwasher, as you can see, it looks even, looking a little bit bare, but all my glassware is here. Oh, those are not soft clothes. <laughs> I thought they were. Um, and then all of our like dinnerware and mugs are here. Um, I get a lot of questions where I got that dinnerware set. It's actually from Kmart, but a long time ago. So I don't know. I don't think it's still there. I haven't seen it. Um, but yeah, the rest is kind of a mess, but that's pots and pans and baking stuff under there um you get the idea let's move on to my second favorite place um the self fridge it's a bit of a mess at the moment but i keep a shopping list here just to keep us organized we rip it off that's our wi-fi password but you don't know where we live so that's okay um anyway our fridge we bought this year it's a little bit of a mess at the moment but i have like organized it as you can see um let's try and keep it organized a little bit crazy at the moment, but that's our fridge. And then my walk-in pantry. <gasps> I love this place. Okay, so um, I get a lot of questions about everything in here. These are the same containers I had in the previous house tour. So they're all from Kmart. Um, I love how they all fit in one shelf and it's like a long shelf. Up top, we just keep our appliances, all of our supplements and Perry's lunch stuff. Um, the next shelf i've got my spice rack also from kmart a little lazy susan with like our um i guess condiments that's from kmart as well a couple more of these containers um this is where i just keep all of our loose spices um in there and down the bottom we've got cans everything's from kmart in here guys so yeah and then baking stuff snacks potatoes onions etc on this side this is zeke's little bottle station so that's where we dry 
his bottles, all his feeding stuff. His sterilizer is from Tommy Tippy. Um, his bottle warm is from Tommy Tippy as well. His bottles are from Tommy Tippy. Um, and this is his Mr. Bottle. Oh my gosh, if you haven't invested in one of these and your formula feeding, like, oh my gosh. It's the best thing that we have ever used. There you go. Um, then on this side is my bottle station. So this is where <laughs> Uh, Perry and I make our coffee. So coffee machine, I always get questions. It's actually the Audi coffee machine. Um, I think it's called the One coffee machine. I don't know, but I love it. Um, we also get our coffee pods from Audi as well. These are from Kmart, these two containers. And I just keep some Biscoff cookies at the back for guests and our coffee syrups behind here as well. Um, underneath the cupboards is honestly just all of Zeke's stuff and some of like my platter stuff as well. So heaps of storage in this house which is what we love. Um, but yeah, that's the um, the kitchen. So do you wanna take everyone through to the laundry in the garage? So out of the pantry, you can see my two boys. <laughs> um, to the left is where it goes through to the laundry in the garage. Perry will show that in a second. And this is our big, massive gold mirror from our last place. Um, so yeah, I'm obsessed with this mirror. It opens up the space, as you can see, it just really works with the dining table in the backyard. Um, but yeah, Perry will take you through now. So as we slide this door, I really love how we can separate the laundry from here because it gets real loud when the clothes are spinning in there. Yeah. Um, but as I turn on the light, the fan turns on because it gets real hot from all the clothes. And so if you can't hear me properly, it's because of the fan. But we've got our washing machine. Let me move my jumper. <laughs> we've got our washing machine right here. Same washing machine from the other place. Got a sink here to wash our And then we things. just try and keep everything else here. Yeah, we've got our vacuum and bin. You know, it's pretty simple in here, just wash your clothes. We really wish we could put our dryer in this area here, but unfortunately we can't because it's a top loader. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. And as we go through here... This is Perry's favorite place. This is my little area, my little escape from these two. <laughs> <laughs> but if you guys know me, you know the garage. My pride and joy right here, my baby. This is his other girlfriend. My little Bluey. Her name is Bluey. <laughs> <laughs> and Perry loves her more than me. But as you come to the left, we have our dryer here. Our second laundry, I guess. Yeah, I guess you can say that. And then we have our little ironing board, which has also like a laundry basket storage thing. basket yeah. type of thing. We can separate stuff. These are from Kmart. We're obviously running low on washing powder, but they're from Kmart. Our iron is from Kogan. The lighting's not the best in here, you guys can see, but we have, what do you call this, a storage? It's a storage unit. This is right. where I keep like all of our Christmas stuff. I just need to get some more labels. Christmas, Easter, Halloween, um, entertaining, gift wrapping, just everything, all, all of those things, um, but yeah. These storage buckets are from Kmart and the storage unit we actually got online so um, yeah but you can get them anywhere. It's a bit messy in here at the moment, not much going on but obviously I have the car, I've got my little simulator set up where I do all my little gaming stuff. If you guys want to know more about this I'm going to post a video on my own channel which is perry.t so you can check that out. Um, but for now yeah this is my little area, car parts everywhere, I need to get it sorted but that's the garage. All right, so as we come out of the garage and the laundry, we have a nice sliding door. I don't know if Georgia mentioned, but look at the view we have from our lounge room as well to the backyard. So nice. But we have the sliding door with the flying net. As we come outside, so we have our little barbecue here where now and then I cook up, you know, some chicken and all that stuff, some meat. And we've got the rest of the area here. We wanted to put like a nice, outdoor lounge kind of yeah. thing, right? But yeah, we haven't bought anything space, yet. But, you know. Yeah, we'll probably get an outdoor lounge here. Um, and then what are you going to do with the backyard? I don't know if you guys saw our last place. The backyard was like shaped weird. It was like, like a zigzag. Do, yeah, you couldn't do anything with it. But right now, we have got all this space. And me and Zeke are going to be playing soccer here when he's able to. Going to set up some goals. Some like, you know, cones for some drills. Yeah. And we're going to go hard. Got a little footballer right here. And look how pretty the view is, guys. That's what we love about this house. It's so like, it's got like a bush behind here. And we love it. Yeah, so behind there, there's nothing there. It's just bush and trees and all the weird stuff back there. So that is it for downstairs. Georgia is now gonna take you guys upstairs and show you guys what's up there. So 
as we come upstairs, the first thing you'll see is this like landing area, which is going to be Zeke's playroom. So right now it's not much because he's still not sitting up by himself yet. Eventually I'm going to deck it out with um, a full on playroom with like a kitchen and a little couch and a ball pit and some storage and stuff. So right now it's just his little play mat, his little like play gym. Um, a little toy box with the toys he has right now and then his favorite thing in the whole wide world the jolly jumper <laughs> um, And all the water mat is also from um, Kmart jolly jumper we got from baby bunting this play mat is from babyhood It also comes with a playpen for when he starts crawling on his own um, This is the tiny love boho play gym. I got it from baby bunting as well I don't know where the toy box is from because it was a gift. Um, and the little building blocks are Peter Rabbit. Um, wow, Zeke. Where are you going? Also, because of stairs and Zeke's gonna start crawling, we're actually gonna put a gate there. We have it in the garage, just don't need it just yet. Yeah, he's nearly there though. He likes swimming though. There's a little swimmer. Over in this little corner, this is going to be my little zone in his play area. This is just my desk, our laptop. Um, this is just where I'm going to get a bunch of like TikTok and YouTube stuff done. Um, these are the other dining chairs from downstairs. But yeah, I posted a little desk organization video on my TikTok. So if you want to see that in the details of everything that I have here. Um, that is on my TikTok. But yeah, so this is the landing. That's pretty much it. Um, the only other thing in this landing is just another linen cupboard. Um, I've started organizing this one. Um, is there a light in here? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even know that. <laughs> I've started organizing this one, but there's still a lot to, to organize. But yeah, that's the upstairs linen cupboard, um, Zeke's play area and my office. And then over there's the bedroom. I'll get Perry to show you the bedroom. Follow me through here. As they say, where the magic happens. This is our room. <laughs> where the our... no sleep happens. Yeah. <laughs> We've got our king bed. Same bed from the last place. We've got some bedside tables, which you got from... I just got those from Kmart. Like here or Kmart? Kmart. Kmart. We're eventually going to do this up properly, get some new bedside tables and stuff, but right now it's just a baby zone, hey. Yes. And I do love our king bed. I can just lay there and enjoy it. Not now that that's our dirty washing basket. That's the washing basket we have. Um, Where's our bed covers from, babe? Where are they from? Uh, I actually don't know. Where are they from? <laughs> They're from Target. If uh, anyone okay. wants to know, Friend they're the same people. ones that we have in our guest room. We'll show you guys in a second. So we have Zeke's little bassinet here, it's where you know he, he sleeps. Yeah, that's mom. from Baby Bunting as well. It's like the Ole Baby. I can't remember. Yeah, and we got a bedside table on this side. Obviously, it's occupied with Zeke stuff. You know, he's got a little sound machine, his camera for when he's asleep in there. And we're downstairs. As you come this way, we have my little wardrobe with all my clothes, my shoes. I got some shoes behind this door as well. You know how it is. Uh, I just got some jewelry and all that stuff, bum bags, just clothes. You know, this is my little area. I get ready enjoy it and then as we come out of here and to the right we have our little ensuite right here so we've got a nice long mirror which i love me and george can stand in there she can get ready on that side i can get ready on this side only got one sink though but it is what it is i uh, prefer more bench top size anyway yeah we got our skincare uh toothbrushes stuff i got my side here which is what i like and george's got her stuff on that side so yeah Shower. shower toilets behind there but... i don't know if you guys remember the last place the shower was pretty small so this one is slightly bigger which is what we like um and that's it for the bathroom mm -hmm. all right so coming out of the bedroom down the hallway got zeke still laying there hey baby zeke we got another hallway To the right, a 
which will be the left, <laughs> is the little guest bathroom, which Zeke has his little baths in here. As you can see, his bath, we store it away so people can move in and out. There's a nice shower. It's a good size. We've never had a shower in this yet. Obviously. I've got all the guest products for guests. Whenever they come over, we've got a bath, which Jordan's had a bath in there. Right. Yeah, one bath. one bath. I used to have a bath like every month and now I've had one bath since we moved in. So we've got the mirror, the sink, and you know how it is. We've got some of Zeke stuff in there, his products. Yeah. And just stuff with guests in here, toothbrushes, mouthwash, and all that kind of stuff. And then after that, coming out, we have the guest toilet. Pretty simple, you know what it is. And coming through here... guest room. Georgia's got it nice and beautiful. All set up nicely. All the cushions. She's got a little, you know, what do you even call this? A little... It's like a guest basket. Just make sure they have everything towel. they need. Obviously if there's two people, then there's two towels. Candle. Yeah. If they want to light a candle. <laughs> a face wash and all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, this room is done up better than our bedroom, but... We've got some bedside tables. They're from our last place as well, so... Where are they from, babe? Ikea. Kmart. They're from Kmart. <laughs> it's always one of those three places. <laughs> but um, they're from our last video, which if you haven't yeah. seen, like I said again, make sure you go check that out. So we got the view, like I said, from the bathroom. You can kind of see over the rest of the houses. They're all single stories where we have and a double. There's the bush behind. There's the bush. And there's then... the bush. <laughs> and then Another there's window. a nice little window out there as well. A double wardrobe double door wardrobe which we Some have hangers for guests we have stuff stored in there because you know yeah. we don't really have guests that much but when we do we move it out and yeah that's that all that's right that. but before we move on to the rest of the house make sure you like comment and subscribe leave a comment down below and let us know what you think of the house and let us know if you have any questions or anything that we haven't told you and go check our first house tour if we haven't showed you something all right let's go <laughs> yeah. all right so before we show you the nursery because i know that's what everyone wants to see let's look at my beauty room but I still love that I have this space for now until potentially we have another kid. Um, but on this side, this is where like most of my sets, I know you guys love me in a two-piece set, um, stay and then some of like my robes and stuff as well. Um, here is just where I store some of my sneakers and all of my tracksuits because I am a tracksuit girl. Um, this is obviously my makeup mirror. The um, bookshelves and all this is from Ikea, by the way. Um, it's all from Ikea. The mirror, I actually got it on Groupon. Very random, but I love it. Had it for ages. So yeah, this is um, Ikea. Um, I can't remember where I got this chair from. We got it from like a random place, so I can't tell you where it is. But yeah, this is my little makeup zone, my perfume over there. This marble tray is from Kmart or Target. I can't remember which one, but Perry also holds his perfume in one in his. Um, on this side, I've got the rest of my sneakers and like my heels and stuff and then some of my handbags. Um, and then this is just like the normal wardrobe it comes with. It's also fully packed with clothes in there. Um, and then just like all my jewelry and sunglasses. And how cute. Yeah. Sure's got photos of us. Those um, were the photos that I got for our first apartment together for yeah. our little bedside tables. Um, but yeah, so I keep them so I can look at them. But yeah. So for those of you that have seen the first video, Georgia had the extended one of this. That's I correct. I just made it smaller. It was like double so the size of this, right? Oh, probably about like that big. Yeah, not double, but like one and Yeah, a half, just yeah. about. So it's good that she could reuse the drawers and just get a different top. Yeah, it's really good. You can change it. And that way I could fit more storage because I have accumulated more things. All right. Now I'm so excited. This is the first time anyone is seeing this finished nursery. I have tried so hard to keep like it hidden um in all my little daily vlogs on tiktok but the nursery is finally finished so let's go have a look at zeke's room <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
So this is Zeke's room. Okay, let's start over here because I wasn't going to get the change table. Um, we ended up getting this off Marketplace and my mum painted it black because it was originally white. Um, these baskets are from Kmart. This one holds his nappies. Uh, and this just holds a bunch of products and things that we need to take care of him. Change mat is from Mocha. We usually have a change mat cover on here, but it's in the wash. Huggies wipes. And then underneath is just where I keep like all of his like overstock, um, like nappies, wipes, cotton buds, nappy bags, everything. Mm -hmm. And then underneath we just keep his little baby scale. Then um, in this corner, I just have his washing basket. I'm doing washing at the moment, so it's empty. And this is his cot. His cot is from Mocha. If you are going to buy one of these cots, don't hang wet towels over the corner because this will happen. It was brand new and it just started coming off straight away. But anyway. Also, if you guys want us or Georgia to do a more in detail um, video of Zeke's room, you know, all the little things, essentials that you need, just leave a comment up below and she will get onto that. Alrighty, so over to his cot, um, this beautiful sign is from Admire on Instagram, I will tag her below, she made this physique, it's custom made, it is so cute, and as you can see, we went with a bit of a Lion King theme, funny little story, I wanted to call Zeke Zimba, but with a Z, um, for Lion King, because that's like my favourite movie, but Perry didn't like it, so we went with the Lion King theme for his, um, for his room, um, this little Lion King mobile I got from Baby Bunting. It was bloody expensive, but you know, love Zeke. Um, the Duna, um, Duna is from Babyhood. Um, this was a gift and this was a gift as well. So his little lion toys go on there. Okay, then the mat on the ground, that's from Kmart. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but it's from Kmart, super affordable. Goes with like the, you know, the vibe in here. Um, this um, rocking, chair. rocking chair is from Babyhood. It is so comfortable and it's got a little foot rest and it goes all the way back and I just love it and it makes me feel so good. I could sleep in this. I could happily sleep in this. Um, then we have a nursing pool. We don't use it as much now that he's bigger, but this one was from TK Maxx. Again, it's Lion, so it went with the theme. All right, so um, the drawers are also from Mocha. They're matching with the cot. Um, his books right now are on top, but once I get his proper play area set up, I will be setting up a little book station for him, a little bookshelf. Are you looking in the mirror? Are you looking in the mirror? Oh, well, we caught you. Um, these are his Bible book books. Um, my auntie used to, and my grandma used to read these to me when I was little. So I'm so excited to have the same ones, um, and some of his books there. The rest of them are downstairs. This is little christening dedication thing um but yeah so these are his drawers let's have them organized they're all his swaddles which we don't really use anymore but i just doing washing so they're a bit empty but this is singlets and his washcloths um as you can see it's just all organized i got the drawer dividers from kmart um to help organize it but yeah these are you this is where we keep all of his like clothes that aren't like i guess brands <laughs> just like his general clothes and then in his wardrobe we keep all of his we'll start on this side um like nice track suits and stuff this is just all his like plain singlet his little robe and look with the lion king his godparents got that for him so cute um all of his singlets a couple of onesies he hasn't worn and then like all of his nice tops like look at this kid he is dripped he is dripped down Designer, designer. Zeke has um, some sick he probably suits. has about like 30 tracksuits, I'd have to say. Um, down here is how I organize all of his clothes that he ran out of. So each bucket is for each size he's run out of, and I've just rolled them up so we can keep them for the next baby. This up here is his little keepsake box. I kept all of his. Ooh. Um, if you don't know, Zeke was in the hospital for the first two and a half weeks of his life. And I kept everything from that time. I also kept his little dedication ceremony, um, yeah, schedule, schedule thing. Um, this is what they had in his little um, bassinet. Yeah. yeah. And they made this for him because he was in there so long. It was so cute. Um, this was his Welcome to the World outfit. If you follow us on Instagram, you'll have seen that. Um, and then I've got like his swaddle and his blanket from the hospital. This was his going home little onesie. I've got his little 
tags <laughs> and the first ever beanie they put him in my little man yeah and that's his little keepsake box i'll get it properly labeled and everything um the other one is just a box for something else um then let's move over to this side so i just keep his baby bags we have one that we send when he stays at his grandparents and the one that we use um the rest of his like track suits and stuff are here all of his shoes are here um so far that he has his little gold bracelet that perry's best friend uh, got him we need to get it sized but super cute um this is where i keep his beanies bibs uh, and socks um yes yeah, so i got these three from kmart they just perfectly fit those in there and these linen baskets from kmart as well i keep his towels obviously in this one and the rest of his like blankets and linen in that one um and that's pretty much it that is his little nursery do you love your room I think he's a bit tired. All right, guys. Well, that is it for the house tour. Like I said before, if you have any questions, leave it in a comment down below. I was so excited to finally share you share with share with you our home. Um, and we will definitely be trying to post more on YouTube. So just comment any ideas of videos you want us to do um, as a family, and we'd love to do them for you. Love you. Bye. Bye.